Hi guys, welcome back to a new video. And oh my gosh, do I have an exciting pen to show you today. I was 100% influenced. Um, I think I mentioned maybe in one of my previous videos about seeing the Kaveco Hello Kitty pen on Charmaine's channel. And she had posted a link to a website that I hadn't heard of before. Um, and they offered like free international shipping. They had it in stock. It was a reasonable price. And I even found a discount code on their blog. So it meant it came under the threshold for paying customs. So I just kind of jumped straight in it. Um, what I will say is this new Spotify feature where it's like one click checkout is very um i i can't think of the word but it's it's bad for me because I, this purchase and another purchase i have gone to the checkout <clears throat> and i have clicked like continue thinking there would be another page um and it's just gone straight through and I wasn't like 100% committed and the reason I would check continue is usually because of um, like the currency conversion so this is the second time that I have accidentally purchased something through a Spotify, Spotify? Shopify built website it is dangerous I don't think I can be trusted but anyway I feel like this is probably going to be my last pen for a while as well I just don't really like have much of a desire for any pens particularly at the moment obviously apart from that platinum that I mentioned beforehand as well that is still at the top of my wish list 100% but I just think it's unattainable one chamomile tea um, so I just think it's unattainable I just don't know anywhere that is going to have it um and I kind of almost came to that realization or that acceptance of it and then decided it was okay to keep this one so I wanted to unbox it with you and I wanted to ink it up as well I was hoping it would arrive like before Valentine's Day but it didn't but that's fine um it's yeah I don't really have like a February inked like line up like pen line up or um anything like that because all of my pens well not all of them but a vast majority of my pens are inked up and I don't mind they just they store the ink really well I have no desire to really change any of them out I don't want to waste the ink just by um, emptying the pen you know down the sink or something like that and cleaning it out so yeah I thought we could unbox this together because I know it comes with little little bits and pieces including this little thing on the back so this is the Kaveco Hello Kitty limited edition I got this in the pink one. I, I did have my eye on like a rose gold Quebeco Sport, like um, aluminium Quebeco Sport on eBay. Someone was selling a few. And I was like, if I can't get this one, or if I if it's not in, I don't know, like for whatever reason, then I might think about getting the rose gold one, but only like second hand. Um, so this is the 50th anniversary of Hello Kitty. Comes with this keychain, which is very cute. It's like one of these um, shaker keychains. As you can see there. So cute. I'm gonna put this on my backpack with all my other like cutesy kawaii things um, and then this is 
box. I hope we're not too too bright up here, but I think we're okay. I think we're okay. So this is the box. Obviously, the sleeve has Hello Kitty's ears and bow and all these cute little gems. Um, and then on the side we have obviously the branding, the 50th anniversary logo, the license and the holographic label and Hello Kitty 50th anniversary so cute so as I said I got this in pink with the gold nib and I don't have any like Kaveco tins so this is nice as well and then it comes with two sheets of little stickers 50th anniversary so we've got the pink and the lilac lilac uh, sticker sheets so I'm gonna pop them in my planner we've got the little instruction or the fun fact I guess of Kaveco Kaveco's history and the guarantee and certification and then this one is just a sticker so I'll pop that somewhere as well and then obviously I have the pen so the pen itself um, the pen itself is only available in a fine nib which is absolutely fine because that's the size that I actually wanted to order anyway and because I oh, it's so weighty because it was um, kind of a bit of a ra not random purchase but you know I explained the Shopify issue I didn't even know like what nib size I had selected and I emailed them like asking them to check and then I went back on the website and I realized oh they're all fine nibs <laughs> So here we are. Um, it says on it 2023 Sanrio Clo Limited. Then on this side it says Kveco Hello Kitty with the little bow. Very cute. And then we have a gold logo finial on there. I can't zoom you in anymore, but you've got that. And yeah, it is weighty, it does take some getting used to you because I'm not used to I don't have any aluminium ones so this is exciting and here we are the nib has Hello Kitty's face on there Let's see if I can try and can you see just very small there oh, so cute and then we've got a nostalgia clip that it comes with I mean Ready for the cost, I feel like this should have been a little nice clip as well that has maybe, because basically I don't know if you can see, it has the Kaveco round logo there and it's the same on the other side and I'm just thinking maybe one of them could have had Hello Kitty's face on it. That would have been nice. Or even on the finial, you know, like a sailor do. So let's open her up and I was like oh my god I thought this was supposed to be a converter no we have a cartridge it is blue I don't like the blue cartridges I never have I doubt I ever will but I do have converter so let me just grab it converter here it's just one of the Kaveco ones for the sport they are tiny but I've I haven't used a um, cartridge in not cartridge converter in a Kaveco sport my other sports have cartridges in them but this one I knew that I wanted to put a nice like dusky pink in oh the nib's coming out just twist that back in. There we go. Well, 
let me put the clip on here as well I think I want it like that that kind of looks wonky it's because I'm not putting at the right angle isn't it great okay let's try third time lucky and we're gonna put it on and then it's not gonna go I'm not gonna put it past the bow I do have like a little scratch on it there now okay scratch just wipes off with water so um, as I said I don't have a tin or I haven't owned a tin before so it's quite nice to have this so I can obviously take Kaveco's with me on the go and this is the ink that I'm gonna put in here is Jacques Urban Rue Donker can't roll my ass though I have been speaking and learning French for how long nine years I didn't get my ink rag out okay just full ink oh just so cute so cute I've not actually swatched this ink properly yet actually either um, last week my Hobonichi here I didn't um, but I didn't want to, um, well not didn't want to, I just didn't end up using the week at all. Um, to be fair, I did, didn't have a very good week, I didn't feel very well, Joey was ill as well. So, let's do her, this is probably a good spot because there's no ink on previous pages or anything. Oops. I really like the fine nib. I really do. Oh, I really like it. I like writing with it, it feels nice. Um, I do prefer it to my other sports, definitely. Oh, 
And the best part is that it's just so cute. Okay. So that's everything. Let me show you. And if you do want to buy the pen, um, it does come in a lilac colour as well. And also a colour called Opal, which is a nice like teal blue. If you are wanting to get your hands on one of these... I will put the link to the website that I purchased from. Um, I do know if you're based in the US, I think Amazon did have some units available. I don't know if they still do, but it's like the same price on this website and they ship internationally um, for free when you spend over $99. So if you're interested, I'll leave it linked below and um i think the discount code that i used for 10 percent off is kitty 50 but again i will link that below or put it below in the description so you can get yourself an additional 10 percent off um which with how things are in the world every little bit helps so I really hope you liked the video and yeah, do you have any pink pens in your lineup? I would love to know because I'm just always on the hunt for a beautiful pink pen. I just absolutely love them. There's a special plate, plate, there's a special place for pink pens in my heart. Um, so yeah, thank you so much you guys for watching today. I hope you have a lovely day or night wherever you are have a cup of tea have a nice rest have a nice weekend as well if it's your weekend and i'll see you guys next time bye bye